The unemployment rate for Americans with disabilities is twice as high as those without. One program is offering young people with special needs a chance to cook up a career and is proving to be a recipe for success. Shelley Botot has details in Health Watch. Students are cooking up a storm for a future career. One program is helping young people with disabilities prepare for the workforce. Just press a little bit. Let me see. Go ahead. Oh my goodness, they're amazing. Chef Wendy Zaka runs a smooth kitchen. The majority of her workers are students with developmental disabilities. I've never set limitations. I, I treat them as if they were typically developing and it seems to work for us. The students ages 14 to 22 are part of a culinary arts high school program that teaches them independent living skills. It's a predictable environment so our students understand where are they going, what they are supposed to do. Last year, the unemployment rate for people with a disability was almost three times the rate of those without. This program aims to change that. Whether it's to cook on the stovetop, bake in the oven, um, wash dishes. They focus on the individual strengths with the goal to provide real life work experience after graduation. My job is to make sandwiches for the military. Stuart Martinez landed a job with Easter Seals after graduating in 2013. It's a lot of work, but I really good at it as well. These young people not only feel a sense of responsibility, but a major sense of accomplishment. Allow them to work in the kitchen with you. Allow them to clean the floor. Allow them to wipe down counters. Let them be productive. Organizing, cutting um, vegetables, gathering and organizing ingredients. Knowing they can do it gives them a confidence they need to move forward, cooking up an exciting career path. Camilla says if you don't have a program like this one where you live, reach out to the public schools in your area and see what vocational programs they offer. Also, you can contact your local Easter Seals for more information. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botot, Local 5 News.